There's been a string of thefts near the TSU campus, and those responsible are still on the loose. But as Jason Bristol shows us, that's by design because that's how baseball games are won. At Texas Southern, the game plan is no secret. The dunk. We're trying to jab them, you know. We're not trying to Phew. be Mike Tyson and, you know, go for the knockout. In other words, there's no power hitters here. A lot of effort. So these Tigers swipe bases, lots of them. And now it's a race to the finish line. Texas Southern is averaging nearly four and a half stolen bases per game. And if that trend continues, they will finish in the top ten in the history of college baseball. We really never thought about the records. We just like, just play our game. The best at it is outfielder Jonathan Thomas. If I see I could take it, I'm like, gonna take it. Leading all of division one in steals. They know that we can do and they try to stop us, but they can't. <laughs> he has the freedom to run on nearly any pitch. Always, yeah, we always have the green light. Actually, they all do. Uh, Coach Rob, uh, he really gives us green light because he has a lot of trust in us. So we just try to use it to our advantage. That's just what we have to do. You know, we have to be very aggressive. We got to take chances. From the time we recruit them, you know, we let them know that 85% of our steals are not on signals. But proper technique is stressed over and over. And there's always a good back and forth over who's the fastest. Who's the fastest? Oh, me, of course. Don't listen to him. Don't listen to him. <laughs> Don't listen. We can get it going after practice. <laughs> <laughs> it's a running joke, naturally, among the best base stealers in the country. Well, Texas Southern stole nine more bases last night against Prairie View A&M. The Division I record for most stolen bases per game is about five and a half, mm. set by Howard University in 1976.